Hi right, guys, Colin here from Precision Optics Eyewear. In this video, I'm going to show you how we go from having a clear lens to a frosted lens. Sometimes you might be asked by your optician to have one lens frosted. I'm going to show you how it's done. Let's have a look. So there's lots of various ways that you could probably frost the lens. I know there's a few ways that you can do it using uh, machinery and other equipment. So this is a little bit maybe more of a traditional old school way of frosting the lens. But basically I'm using a different series of grit types of wet and dry sandpaper. You can probably do this dry, uh, but I just find you get a, a bit more of an even, uniform finish using wet and dry, going from a slightly bigger grit sandpaper down to a smaller grit. And when we talk about different grit, what I'm talking about is basically how rough or smooth the sandpaper is. So I normally start off on a slightly uh, harder, bigger grit sandpaper, it's a little bit more rough, and I work down to go a little bit smoother just to get rid of any visible scratches and lines on the actual lens. So one thing to bear in mind is if you're cleaning your glasses and you have a frosted lens, when you apply any lens cleaners for it, you will think that you've completely ruined it. So as you can see, when you apply liquid to a, uh, the frosted side, it almost goes clear again. And I've had some clients that have said before, I think I've wiped the, uh, <laughs> the frosting off. But as soon as it dries, it goes back to being completely frosted again, which you'll see here. Okay, so the job's all done. That's the finished outcome. As you can see, I'll do the frost on the back surface of the lens to keep the anti-scratch and the shiny front there still. So from an aesthetics point of view, it doesn't look too bad. But as you can see, you've got a lot less light passing through it now. So that's exactly what we're after. You can go for you know, maybe more of a darker or a deeper uh, level of frosting, but this is exactly what we need for this particular client. So that's all done. And if you've got any questions, pop them in the comments below and I'll be happy to answer them. Thanks a lot. Bye-bye.